Hey guys, it's Jess. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm actually in Charlotte, North Carolina. I'm going to be doing a bit of plant shopping. You guys, it's been such a long week for me. I figured I'd do a little plant shopping to make myself feel a little bit better. I've actually hit up all the nurseries in my city, so I figured I'd hit up a different city and bring y'all along with me. So I actually follow several shops on Instagram, and I know one of them posted that they have an elephant planter in stock that I specifically drove down here to get. Actually, I came down here to go to Ikea. I had some things I ordered and had to pick up, so they're in the back. But yeah, I figured I'd take y'all along with me. Hopefully, I can find some goodies. Um, I want to try and hit up four shops today, one being Plant Bar. Y'all heard me talk about that one. I do also want to hit up Malone's, Oakdale, and possibly Grow. We'll see. But let's go see what I can find. Okay, so I just got to Oakdale's and they have a ton of greenhouses, you guys. It's huge in here, so let's see what they have in this first one. Okay, y'all, so I am in the first greenhouse. They have like four or five here, but they have a ton of stuff. Like, they're so stocked. I don't know if you guys can hear me with this mask and this fan is like super loud, but I'm gonna try and get as much footage as I can. There's a lot of people. It's Saturday, it's busy in here, so I'll try to get what I can for you guys, but let's check out what the first greenhouse has. So here's kind of an overview of the first uh, greenhouse that I'm in here. And they just have so much stuff, you guys. Look how stocked they are. This is just the first greenhouse. I'm so excited. So, of course, the first thing that caught my eye are these huge aglaonemas over here. They've got the BJ Freeman, $34.95. They've also got the huge Silverados in stock. These are actually $59.95. Just like the one that I have. I think mine might be a little bit bigger, but... So, so pretty, y'all. And I love how they label everything. They make it really nice. So here's some palms. We've got some bird's nest ferns. Some ficus triangularis for $34.95. Philodendron birkins, $25.95. We've got the black velvet alocasias, you guys. Oh my gosh, I actually just got one, but these are so much bigger, like, $24.95? That is not bad. And look how big these leaves are. They are huge. And I just love the undersides. Like, that purple is gorgeous, y'all. So the smaller ones are $18.95. And then we've got the Maharani's also. $24.95? Well, I might get one of these. I don't know. My black velvet's doing well so far, y'all. I'm not experienced in allocations at all, so I don't know, guys. That might be on my list. I might have to come back and get that. Let's see what else. Got some fiddly figs over here. Rubber trees. I got some small tenekis for $10.95. Money trees. Janet Craig. Philodendron Moonlight, $16.95. We got some nice Bird of Paradise. Okay, so this is one that I came for. This is the Calathea Crimson, $11.95. Ooh, and they only got a few left, you guys. Hmm. Some heart ferns. I love these. They're fuzzy and they're heart shaped. How can you not love that? Magic Stars are $11.95. I might get another one to combine with the one that I have because mine only has like four leaves left now because I've been neglecting it. Okay, so let me pause for a second, figure out which one of these crimsons I want, and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So, got some anthuriums here, some marantas, some really pretty calatheas. I might have to get another one of these two. This is what I came for, you guys. I came for some calatheas. I'm actually redoing my calathea corner and making a whole room for my calatheas, so trying my hand again with these plants, and they have so many to choose from. But I think the thing for me is I need to start with larger plants. How much is this? $20, and that's a good-sized plant. 
Apparently the medallion is supposed to be one of the easier purple backs, Calatheas, to start with. So might get one of those. I just got two rosies, rosio pictos, I should say. Look at this Tremanthi Triostar. I've never seen it with such large shoots like that. Abonimas, there's another Sanguina. $44.95. We've got a nice large philodendron back there in the back. Some ZZs. Arapis palm. Staghorn ferns. French silver staghorn. Never seen that one before. Got the Congo green. They've got the Macaulay Spinelli. $16.95. That's actually not a bad price for a six inch pot. Mine was much larger, but that's a good price for that size. I'm gonna have to get one of these for my friend. Got the Moonlight. Baby Moonlights are only $8.95. And then Prince of Orange. Some nice trailing philodendron, Brazils, lemon line uprights, and some ivy. We've got a really nice selection of expansive areas as well, you guys. So nice how they label everything. I'm trying to go slow so you guys can see the tags, not make you too dizzy. I like this black dragon. That's pretty. Super black gold, Laurentii, Velanica. Just got one of those from Home Depot. Oh, they got the Whitney's too. They actually call theirs Silver Flame, but I purchased mine as a Whitney. So pretty. $30 for that one. Black corals. Really nice snake plants. Okay, let's make our way over this way. Some more Aglaonema, Silver Bays. Some Dracaenas. Got a bunch of Adansoni eyes up here hanging. $34.95. Mm, oh, look at this Calathea Maculana. $35. So this is the size I think I need to start with, you guys. I need to start with them bigger, more established. I really like this Calathea Illustrious. The leaves on that is so pretty. That's going in the cart. Got some nice philodendron reds, imperial reds. And some crotons. It's been kind of packed in here, so let me go ahead and get the cut, this plant that I want. Check out all the color on these crotons. So, so pretty. Nice arrowhead plant. Ooh, what is this? That's interesting. Got a nice thick vine on it. Never seen that before. Got a philodendron sanadu. Silver bay. Got them on stairs over here. I've always eyed this plant. I've been eyeing this plant for like two years now, and thirty dollars. I've never seen it this big. Ugh, you guys, I'm so overwhelmed. Ooh, look, some really nice regal shields. I love the undersides of the leaf. So pretty. But me and Alocasia are not experienced yet, so I might hold off on that. I love this Anthurium Cucurii. I might have to get one of those too. I don't know. $45, $46.95. I might keep shopping on that. Sorry. Got some Altissimas, Tenekis. Really pretty dumb canes. Look at this Tropic Marianne. 
can't wait till mine gets this big. It's so pretty. Okay, so that's pretty much gonna wrap it up for this first greenhouse. Let's make our way to the next one. Hopefully it's not as packed in here. So this looks like it's the succulent uh, greenhouse. They've got a ton of like Hoyas, succulents. I might come back to this because you guys know succulents are not really my thing, but I do have viewers that enjoy them. So I will come back towards the end and do a walkthrough for you guys. But I'm gonna keep moving since there's nobody in here right now. Lots and lots of palms, very tropical vibes. I love it, but I cannot keep these things alive at all. Let's see what we have in this greenhouse. This is greenhouse number three. Okay, so this is the last greenhouse and I don't know which side to start on. Let's start on this side. We got some pretty oxaluses here. Some spider plants. Peperomia, obtusifolia. I love these plants. Like, I know it looks really basic, but mine is just doing so well. It's one of my favorite plants. Some cute little jellies. They have a really nice collection of peperomias. And these tags are a little farther back. I hope you guys can still see. I'm trying to go slow. And some polka dot plants. And calatheas. Got more peperomias over here. They got the watermelon, $10. Might have to get one of these. Aaliyah's. Pretty, pretty begonias. I really like this torch pink. And they're in bloom, you guys. I think the blooms are so pretty and dainty on these. And I love, look at that color. That red underside of the leaves is so pretty. Okay, so that's it for this half. And then down on this end, we have Diffenbachia, goldfish plants for $11.95. Got some tricolors. I really like that combination here in the white pot. It's really pretty. Try to sketch in the nooks. $8.95. And more goldfish plants. And down here we've got some Christmas cactus, some Calathea vitatas, more oyster plants. The BJ Freeman. Oh, y'all, they've got the Jubilee in stock. It's just labeled Chinese Evergreen, but this is the Jubilee. $9.95, not bad. There's another one over there. Oh, and they've got some really nice ferns, you guys. Maidenhair ferns, East India ferns, Autumn ferns. Crocodile fern. I really want one of these, but I see them all the time, so I might get that another trip. Bird's nest ferns. These are the easiest ferns ever in life. And then some nice ficus autosemas. All right, you guys. So I'm going to head back to the succulent uh, greenhouse to give you guys a little bit of tour of that area, and then I'm going to check out. Okay, so we're back at the succulents. They have some really nice Hoyas, you guys. The Hoya Rubra. The Wyetii. The Labates. Hindu Ropes. They've got some Prince and Queens. Wow, y'all. And we've got some aloe plants behind me here. Got some little string of hearts for ten dollars. Some Hoya carry eyes. Some Hoya retusas. 
Oh, I love these like succulent terrarium arranges. So cute with the eyeballs. Okay, so let's look at the succulents that they have. We've got some string of pearls. Lots and lots of assorted cacti. Got some agaves. I love this one, but mine unfortunately got mealybugs and I didn't know what to do with it then. So yeah, I might give that a try another day. Of dolphins. They've got the bunny ears, my fave. What a spotty oddie back there. Maybe one day I'll get into cacti and succulents, but today is not the day. So that was Oakdale's. I did get some goodies, which I will show you guys at the end of this video, maybe. I might save them for my haul. We'll see. But I think I'm going to head to Malone's. Let me take this mask off. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. I think I'm going to head to Malone's next, and then we'll see if we have time to hit up Plant Bar and grow. So let go. Okay, so now we are at Malone's. Y'all, I am so excited to go inside, but I'm going to check out the pots first just to make sure they have the elephant planter that I want. And then I'll give you guys a tour. So you guys, this is now their pot house. And they're still bringing in stock, but I think they're pretty well stocked. Ooh, guys, I love this kind of like rose gold. Look, I know it doesn't look rose gold on my camera, but it's really pretty. $12, and it has drainage. These are really pretty. I'm gonna have to get a couple of those for my office. Where is the elephant? That's what I'm hunting for. So these are all 15. I'm not really a fan of the pots that come with saucers, but I do own some. Oh, these are so cute. $10. Oh, these are so cute. Look at the little seal. Oh my gosh. So, so cute. Well, these are kind of nice. $20. $3.
really nice outdoor pots as well. Really nice. Ooh, I see some purple and blue, kind of like the ones that I bought last year outdoors. Let me see how much these are. So the smallest one is 40, medium is 60, and the large one is 80. So pretty, I never thought I would see this color mixture again. Oh, that's exciting. I hope our local nursery gets more in stock this year as well. Ooh, this is really pretty. Okay, so let's see what they have in here. Lots of little succulents. Wow, check out this totem in and You guys are looking. $40. Really nice cacti, you guys. If y'all are looking for cacti, this is the place to come. Like, we have so much in here. Okay, I see a few house plants on that side. Let me head that way. It's a nice a bird of paradise. Three in a pot. For how much does that say? Forty-five dollars. Really pretty big. Starting to bloom. Oh, so they got some moonlights for fifteen dollars. Really pretty. Oh, they've got some pretty rosies. Ten dollars. So that was Malone's, you guys. I'm so excited that they still had... Let me take this off. Sorry, y'all. So I'm so excited that they still had the planter that I was looking for. I'm so excited about that. Um, but they didn't really have a lot of house plants in there. Like, not like I was expecting. If you're looking for cacti and succulents, then definitely hit up Malone's. Um, but I did also see that they had the rosy in there. And it was a little cheaper. It was $10. Um, but it was way smaller than the one that I got from... Oakdale and it was only a dollar more at Oakdale so I'm glad I got that there and just looking at the time you guys I don't think I'm gonna have time to go to plant bar this trip or the other store that I wanted to go to unfortunately but 
I will be back down here next week because I have to come back to Ikea because they were out of stock of something that I wanted and it'll be in stock next week. And I could have it delivered, but delivery was like $129. And I was like, no, I'll just drive an hour and come pick it up. So maybe I can hit up Plant Bar next week. But y'all, I just feel so much better. Like plant shopping just relaxes me. I got some cute little plant babies that I'm going to enjoy. So yeah, I just feel so much more happy. So yeah, glad I made this trip. I hope you guys enjoyed shopping along with me. I hope you saw some things that maybe you're inspired to purchase. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're not already following me on Instagram, follow me there. I'm way more active on Instagram than I am here on YouTube. Also subscribe if you're interested in seeing more from me. And as always, thank you guys so much for joining me. I'll catch you in my next video. Peace.